First, take out of all items from the package. There are monitor, camera, two brackets, sunshade, two video cables, lighter adapter, screws, power cable. Take out the monitor. Install the sunshade to the monitor. Take out the screw pack. Pick up the bracket. Align the stand with the screw holes on the side of the monitor. Fix the monitor and stand with screws. Tighten the screws. The operation is the same as before. Follow my operation. The U-bracket can be flexibly adjusted. After adjusting the angle, tighten the screws. Pick up the 3M sticker. Tear off the 3M sticker and paste it on the bottom of the bracket. Tear off the other half of the 3M sticker and paste it on the dashboard. Rotate the screw on the windshield now, like my way. Move the cube. Take up the back of the monitor. Slide the cube into the back of the monitor, like my way. You can adjust the position you want, tighten the screw. You can mount it on the windshield. Pick up the extension wire. Connect the extension wire to the monitor. Like my operation. There have one DC connector, V1 video cable and V2 video cable. The thin blue wire is the reversing trigger wire. Pick up the 23 feet extension wire. Like my operation. Connect the 23 feet end to the monitor extension cable. Tighten the screws. Connect the other end of the 23 feet to the camera. Tighten the screws. Pick up the camera. There are two screw holes on the camera. The camera bracket can be flexibly adjusted. After adjusting the angle, take out the screws. Fix the camera bracket with screws. Like my operation. You can use the other two screws to fix the camera where you want. Connect the cigarette lighter to the monitor for power supply. Plug the adapter to the power. Press the red button. The monitor lights up. We can also use 12 volts power supply to power the monitor. Like my operation. Pick up the power cord. Connect the power cord to the monitor. The red wire is connected to the positive of the 12 volts power cord. The white wire is connected to the negative of the 12 volts power cord. The monitor lights up. If the 23 feet cable is not long enough, you can use the 43 feet cable. Disconnect the 23 feet cable. Connect the 43 feet cable to the camera. Tighten the screws. Connect the other end of the 43 feet cable to the extension cable. Tighten the screws. The monitor lights up. Pick up the camera. Please cover the light sensor on the camera and the camera infrared nights will turn on dull red.
pick up the monitor. Press the power key to turn off the screen. Press the power key again to turn on the screen. The second key is up key. The third key is down key. The CH key is used to switch to the camera channel. Press the CH key to switch to the AHD1 channel. Press the CH key again to switch to the AHD2 channel. Press the M key to enter the menu mode. The system automatically exits the menu mode after 3 seconds. Press the SEL key to turn on the guideline. Press the SEL key again to turn off the guideline. Press the M key to enter the menu mode. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to adjust brightness. You can also adjust the contrast, saturation, tint. Press the SEL key to switch the contrast, saturation, tint. Press the M key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the car. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to turn on, off the guideline. Press the SEL key to switch to the car delay. Press the up or down key to adjust the car delay time. You can also turn off the car delay function. Press the M key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the mode. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to rotate the image. Press the SEL key to switch to the zoom. Press the up or down key to switch screen size ratio. Press the SEL key to switch to the mirror one. Press the up or down key to turn on, off the mirror mode of the AHD1 channel. Press the SEL key to switch to the mirror 2. Press the up or down key to turn on, off the mirror mode of the AHD2 channel. Press the M key to return to the previous interface. Press the up or down key to switch to the SYS. Press the SEL key to confirm. Press the up or down key to select the language you want. Press the SEL key to switch to the screen save. Press the up or down key to adjust the screen save time. For example, if you set 3 minutes, when there is no image on the channel, it will automatically switch to a black screen after 3 minutes. Press the SEL key to switch to the reset. Press the up or down key to reset the monitor. The VIR is used to view version information. The system automatically exits the menu mode after 3 seconds. Press the SEL key to turn on the guideline. When the guideline appear on the screen. Press the M key. When the H appear on the screen. Press the up or down key to move the guideline left and right. Press the M key. When the V appear on the screen. Press the up or down key to move the guideline up and down. Press the M key, when the W appear on the screen. Press the up or down key to adjust the width of the guideline. The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord.
plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom, 